guys, so this is actually my second part of monthly favorite of February. I also have another episode of um, monthly favorite about only beauty related products. I'll link it there, so there, so you can check it out. And um, I, I was gonna put everything together, but that one went so long, so I decided to separate them out. So in case you are not interested in beauty related products, or you are only re interested in beauty products, you can choose whichever part you, uh, you're gonna watch. So this part, again, is just gonna be everything that has nothing to do with makeup or um, clothes or anything. Just like some random lively stuff. So, okay. So the first thing I'm going to show you is the um, two cases I got for my iPhone and my iPads. Um, so, I've been constantly changing my case because I never find a really cute one. But in February, I found this gorgeous guy's online on eBay and I told myself I have to get it and I promise I would never change my phone case again. Look how gorgeous it is. It's the Anna Sui theme. Anna Sui is my favorite designer and I got it in light purple. You guys know I like light purples. Um, obviously look at my shirt and my necklace and my nail polish and stuff. So yeah, this is my phone case I got from eBay and I like it. It's really gorgeous and very bling bling. I got all this little girly stuff. And then the next one is the case I got from my iPads. I used to have a iPad case from um, Juicy Couture, but that one, the problem is you can't make it stand. Sometimes I want to um, make it stand and type. Sometimes I want to just put them there and watch some video. And that case cannot satisfy me. So I got this case, which is another gorgeous design. I think it's uh, Romero Brito inspired. Um, Romero Brito is another favorite um, designer of mine. So I found this on Amazon. I like it, so I decided to get it. So the cool thing about this case is it's very hard. Obviously, it protects your iPads from dropping or scratching. And the other thing, the cool thing about, about it is you can use it as a stand. So it has this like danced slot right here, like two slots. You can adjust it is to be stiffy or to be more flat so you put them on like this I'm not sure if you, you guys can pick it up so you put this iPad here in one slot and then it just stands like that see where you can put in more slight whichever angle you prefer so it actually stands so this one um, I can just use it and then put them in there when I watch a video or something. It's very convenient and the design is cute. I like it. It's from Amazon, I believe is $17, which is not bad. And the next product I'm going to show you is, alright, so um, I late recently got a few um, makeup brush sets. Okay, and I want to use them every day. I don't want them to just lay on the, you know, the wrapper came with the brush. I want to just them to be just dipped in. And I was having trouble finding a cute brush holder. Like all the brush holder, I, I mean, I can go to buy like a, like a little boring box, obviously, and put them in. But I don't want to. I want my brush holder to be cute. And um, I've been always craving the one that in Sephora, you know, in Sephora they have all those jars with the little uh, crystal bead and you just dip in and the brush just stand in because the beads surround it and hold it. And I was inspired by Sephora but I wouldn't want to pay that much to purchase the crystal beads. So I went to a dollar store and I found this cute little, I think it's a vase or like the jars they use to put some plants but I just decided to get it. They have all different colors. I got one um, 
in green, I got one in yellow. And they both have this little um, sunflower. Oh, my finger is just covering it. Because this sunflower is on it. It's very pretty. And I also got those marbles like that. See, you, you guys see the marbles? I got those marbles a dollar for the whole jar of marbles um they are originally designed for you know fill in the vase so you can have like a, a clear vase and like the and fill by the marbles but i just decided to get it and to hold my brush i'm not sure if you guys yeah i got the um transparent green with my green jar and i got those like glossy shining gorgeous um, sea blue one with my yellow jar so yeah I put them in and here's my brush so what you can do is you just dip them in see it just holds your brush perfectly and forgive me if the brushes look dirty because I just did um, makeup with these brushes so see they just hold your brush like that. You can just, you have to push a little bit harder to put them in. But once you get them in, it just holds your brush like perfectly. You can just obviously see which one you want. And then they separate them from, you know, like the bacteria just transfer them. I like it. It's, I think it's really cool. And along with the jar, I bought a... Um, a strain of sunflower. I just think it enlightened my room and my life and my mood a lot. I think just by seeing this kind of flowers, it just make my it just made my day. I, it made me so happy. So I bought this one. I'm just gonna dip in like either one of my jar. It looked like that. Isn't it cute? Love it. So that will be on my makeup table. That's my idea of how to make your uh, own like brush holder. It doesn't cost me like more than I know five dollars, six dollars, and it just make my table looks different. So that's that. And the next thing I'm gonna show you is oh February. There's two things like huge thing happened in February. One is Chinese New Year, and one is the Super Bowl football so the next two things I'm gonna show you is about those two things so the first one is the Super Bowl um you guys know I'm a huge fan of New York Giants I'm from New York New Jersey area and um, Giants is definitely my team and my boyfriend's team and my whole family's team and my whole family and friends team so everybody around me likes Giants and so do I. So Giants this year, 2011 to 2012, they won the Super Bowl champion, which is a huge, huge thing in my family and friends circle and in our whole community. We love Giants and we were so excited when they won the Super Bowl champions. And the funny thing is actually the Super Bowl night, I was in Boston. You know, I went to Boston to visit my cousin because that weekend is her birthday so I went to Boston and ironically Giants were playing New England Patriots in the Super Bowl and I was like surrounded by all those Patriots fans and I was the only one that like secretly said okay go go Giants and they were like stop them stop them so I was like go 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 but anyway yeah so my team won so I got a whole set of magnet magnetic like this magnets of Giants logo Giants helmet Giants I have a, like a Giants on my car I have this one and another like New York the NY logo on my refrigerator and I got this one at the party that night I watched football I'm just gonna keep it because it's so memorable and I was so happy that Giants won so congratulations Giants and the next one is Chinese New Year. I got this one. Uh, no, I personally didn't got this one. My boyfriend got me this one. Um, we went to Chinatown at the Chinese New Year, and we were at this like arts and craft store, and they were selling all those cute little dragons and you know lion stuff and all those Chinese traditional 
um, stuff. And he bought me this one because I know, like, uh, he knows that I collect stuffed animals. I love stuffed animals. And this is a cute one. It's not like a, like a boring, you know, dog, rabbit, rat, kind of like boring stuffed animal. It's a little dragon with the little bowls in his mouth. It says, um, money on it. And he obviously knows I love money too. So, but anyway, he bought me this one. I think it's really cute. And we named him Boo Boo because... Um, he also got me another stuffed animal, which is uh, octopus, um, for my birthday, and that one we named her Poo Poo, and I think, and so we named this guy Boo Boo, their brothers and sister, so I think it's really cute, I like my little dragon, say hello Poo Poo, yeah, there we go, so that's that, so the next one I'm going to show you guys, the last one for this random monthly favorite is this um vitamins um so i've been like a lot of my friends around me started to take vitamin years ago and i was just like tell myself i'm still young i don't need supplements i just got everything and i don't need to um take vitamins only old people take vitamins but anyway and I found this one, and it says hair, skin, and nails. I mean, from the name, it doesn't sound like that old. It doesn't say, oh, prevent cholesterol, oh, prevent heart attack, prevent, like, diabetes. Um, it just sounds like young and, you know, beauty-related and very feminine, very girly, very, you know, like... It's just like a feminine hair and it says hair, skins and nails which happen to be the three things I care most about in my life. I want my hair to be luxurious, I want my nails to be stronger and stop like chipping and breaking and I want my skin to look better. So I'm like, okay, let me, you know what, let me try this out. Just give it a shot and see what happens. And he actually helps a lot. I mean, I don't know if this is my, you know, psychological hint, like, I'm just, like, implied to myself, or it actually really helps. I don't know, but my nails never break ever after I start taking it. My nails used to break a lot. It just hap it just break, like, in the middle of nowhere. It just, in, when I wash my dishes, when I, you know, move my furniture, when I even write and you know shower just like break to like into two parts but ever since I take this one my nails stop breaking and my hair seemingly to grow a little bit faster and my skin I don't know I I feel like I'm I'm just like psychologically hint myself too much but Anyway, I, I feel like it helps, and I definitely recommend it. Um, I mean, I bought it by myself. I'm not sponsored or, like, attached to anyone. And um, no one is, you know, paying me to advertise for it. But I just feel like it helps. I mean, it might be just my personal feeling. Um, but I, I will keep, like, taking it. So, yeah, that's my favorite stuff for the month February and um, don't forget to check out the beauty um, related monthly favorite if you're interested in so um, yeah and I will see you guys in my next video